And hello, YouTube, and welcome back to another episode of The Zone TV Movie Entertainment. With me, your host, Jonathan, and once again, bringing you my thoughts and review for tonight's episode of DC's Legends of Tomorrow, Season 5, Episode 6. So, tonight's episode was very, very fun. Good, you know, cool comedy moments. Very, you know, moments that were like, okay, what's going to happen this time? Because, you know, certain things happened from last episode that leads into this one. So, if you haven't been caught up, spoiler alert for those episodes and also tonight's episode. So, we all know that John Constantine pretty much has, like, I guess, a contract with the pretty much, with, um, with Astra. I think it's Astra. Yeah, with Astra. She has, like, a charm that has, like, a clock, like, a, like, a clock wheel, like, gears in the back of it that if she turns it, she can pretty much kill him, like, right away. Like, apparently he has, like, a thousand years or something on his life and, you know, of lung cancer, so she sped it up to basically kill him in like 20 hours and the guy did not look good the guy was pretty much puking up blood they tried to get Cora to come help out um, they tried to get Nora to come help out because she's a godmother now so she has the magical powers too to try to have a little girl <laughs> wish him to be better that didn't work you know Ray and uh Gary are with him trying to do that while that's all happening you have uh Charlie and the rest of the team led by Ava since Sarah's not there yet. Still no explanation where she is at. She just had something to do with Central City, so who knows? Um, they have to basically deal with Genghis Khan. Genghis Khan, for some reason, just popped up in Hong Kong in 1994, started causing trouble. So the legends had to pretty much tend to him. They did. He was going after Prince Charles and you know try to build up his army of how he used to be back in the day. But this time he was using scooters, so that was pretty funny, and using guns. So I thought that was pretty cool. Uh, the whole thing, and then we find out about the truth about uh, Charlie, how she's an old centuries, I guess, witch kind of thing, and um, her sisters are coming after her. Her powers are starting to, you know, get affected because she sends that her sisters are coming through. She had a, she has something to pre prevent them from coming after her, put away. But since crisis happened, it kind of brought it back. So now she's pretty much warning the team, hey, listen, I got to go because if my sisters catch me now, they're going to kill me and you guys as well. So we got to see that. We thought that was pretty interesting. <laughs> the whole Genghis Khan thing was pretty cool because, you know, Genghis Khan's a pretty funny character, I guess, and in, in the way they interpret him in, you know, TV or movies. So um, I thought that worked really well. The whole scooter thing, that was a little bit too much, but, you know, it was fun for what it was. And I, I really like the whole stuff about Gary and um, Ray trying to help out um, Constantine because the dude was pretty much in bad shape. But then he made the deal to Astra pretty much, hey, listen, you help me, you give me back my, my good health and I'll get your mother back. So they made a deal at the end of it to him trying to get his her mother back. So how that's going to play out, how's John going to do it? Maybe he'll have like a... A trick up a sleeve if he brings her back in a certain way. Who knows? We have to wait for it comes back in two weeks when they're gonna play Mr. Rogers and the puppets are back. So that's all I know for next week's the next episode. All I know, puppets are back, so that's gonna be interesting seeing. But like I said, very very cool episode. I liked how in this episode you got to see Nora come in. She has a little her new little you know girl, a new godchild pretty much, and she's trying to help you know, Constantine, and say, oh, yeah, she tells the little girl, help Constantine, doesn't work, and then it goes chaotic, so there's that, so, like, cool, funny, cool moments, but, you know, let's see what happens moving forward, I really am liking Legends of Tomorrow, it's very funny, Mick shows up at the near end and doing his wacky drinking stuff, so that was fun, but, um, I am enjoying, I am, am enjoying, um, Legends of Tomorrow, it's funny, it's hilarious, great action stuff, all the characters are all great, I love all of them, and, um, I can't wait to see more. So leave me a comment below. Let me know what you guys thought about it. And stay tuned for more. Thank you very much and have a good night.